Mama June's boyfriend, Gino Doke, has been sentenced to just over a year of jail time in connection with a 2019 felony drug possession charge. Gino Doke, who is Here Comes Honey Boo Boo star Mama June Shannon's boyfriend, has been sentenced to just over a year of jail time in connection to a 2019 felony possession case. Gino and Mama June have had quite the journey together over the past few years as a couple. June's kids blamed Gino for starting their mother's drug addiction and for the downward spiral her life took after meeting him. Prior to dating Gino, June had a show on TLC that highlighted her weight loss journey and her attempts to keep off the weight after losing it. It was successful and inspired many fans who were on their own weight loss journeys. That show was canceled but turned into Mama June, Family Crisis, which followed June and her family as they tried to get through to her and snap her out of her addiction. While filming that show, June admitted to her children that she had gotten to the point of spending $2,500 a day on methamphetamines. Her habit had gotten so bad that she was forced to sell the family home in order to continue to finance her addiction. Despite her daughter's claims that her addiction was Gino's fault, June said during the special that she got high simply because she wanted to and for no other reason. At the time, her youngest daughter, Alana, had moved out and was living with her older sister, Lauren. They did not want their 13-year-old sister around drugs and living with drug addicts. After her 2019 arrest, June told her children she was working on getting clean and promised that she was trying her best to get better. Mama June's boyfriend has now been sentenced to just over a year of jail time after he was arrested on felony possession charges in Alabama back in 2019. According to TMZ, Jano agreed to a plea deal in which he will serve 16 months in Macon Community Corrections for his drug charges. As per his plea deal, Gino will not have to spend any time in an actual jail cell, but he'll have a list of rules he has to follow or else he will be put behind bars. Gino and June were arrested together in 2019, but June will not have to serve any jail time. She previously agreed to a plea deal in which she had to serve 100 hours of community service as well as stay sober. After completing his 16 months, Gino will have to serve two years of probation and take part in a substance abuse treatment slash evaluation program. Both June and Gino have to stay sober as part of their plea deals and seem to be doing a good job of it so far. February 2021, June and Gino celebrated a whole year of sobriety, which she commemorated with an Instagram post. In the caption, June detailed the day they realized they needed help and when they finally reached out to production to find them help. They went to a rehab center in Florida for 23 days and have been holding out strong ever since. Having been sober for a year now, June has now realized she wants to work inside a rehab and help others who are in the situation she once was in. Fans were afraid that when Gino was sent to prison, June would slip back into her old ways out of sadness. June herself has admitted to having an addictive personality, so it wouldn't take much for her to fall back into her drug addiction. Since Gino will not actually physically be in prison, things may be easier for the Here Comes Honey Boo Boo alum to deal with. Fans can stay updated on June's journey on Mama June. Road to Redemption